Hello and welcome to Nerdio Manager for WVD demo of the day. And in today's video, we are going to look at monthly active users and historical usage and the, the ability to export that usage right from the homepage of the Nerdio Manager for WVD. So if you want to track at what type of utilization your WVD environment is getting from the users, there's really multiple dimensions you can look at. There is the dimension of what is called the named users, meaning how many users have been assigned to your host pools and app groups in your environment uh, at a workspace or WVD tenant level. There is something called concurrent users, meaning how many users have connected to the environment at the same time, which is really your peak compute capacity. So it's helpful to know how many users are on the system at a maximum at any given time. And then there is a new metric that was introduced in version 2.1.0 of the Nerdio Manager called the monthly active users. Monthly active users tells you how many unique users have logged in to a WVD desktop over the prior month whether or not that was concurrently or not concurrently, but it's, it's the people that have logged in, the unique users that have logged in into the system in the previous 30 days. And you can see all of this information summarized right here on the workspaces or on the tenants page under the usage column. And it's also possible to click on any one of these values and that will open up a graph that's gonna show you the last 30 days of how many users were assigned, how many users were monthly active users as of a particular day, how many users were logged in concurrently into the system, and also how many CPU cores you had um, that's been consumed by the environment, the infrastructure of WVD. So, so really the monthly active users is the new graph that was added recently, and it helps answer the question, how many actual people are logging into the system in the course of a month? Now, another option you'll notice here is an export usage button. If you click on export usage, that will generate a CSV file that will provide you with the last 30 to 180 days worth of data for these four um, items here, named users, monthly active users, concurrent users, and CPU cores. So you can actually look historically at how the environment has been utilized. Hope you found this useful, and I am looking forward to seeing you in future videos.